Hello everyone, in today's video I'll be showing you how to use the Capcom CPS1, CPS2, and CPS3 emulators, arcade emulators for RetroArch. So let's begin. So first thing you need to do is you need to get the core. So go to main, go to load core, go to download a core, go to arcade, You need Arcade FB Alpha 2012 CPS1, CPS2, CPS3. I have downloaded all of them. As you can see with the pound sign, that means I already downloaded it. But if you didn't, you could download them. And then after that, just restart RetroArch. Now what you need to do is you need to go to show go to menu go to show desktop op desktop menu press a and now you have this let's click ok here let's make a list a playlist so go right click with your mouse new playlist i'll call it capcom cps1 I'll give you the URLs on where you can find the stuff. Go here and download it, whatever you want. I don't know that you could. There's a lot of stuff you could download, ROMs or whatever, and put it into your ROMs directory for CPS. put it in there like that now I got all my games or whatever I'll move it to that CPS 1 playlist Just highlight everything and just dump it in there like so and go here press OK now I got all the ROMs for that so I want to create the next one CPS 2 Go here, so CPS2. Here's the CPS2 games, ROMs. You could download them here. Whatever you want, you could download it and make a list or put it into a directory, okay? Now I'm going to go to my CPS2 and just put in all the games. Okay, and I want to make another directory called CPS. Okay, go here. Go to this URL and download all the CPS 3 ROMs, whatever you want. Go to my CPS. ROMs directory and dump all my ROMs in there as well. Okay. The next thing I want to do is I want to associate core. So go right click, associate core with CPS1 for CPS1. CPS2, go to associate core with FB Alpha 2012 CPS2. Next one. Right click, associate with core, FB Alpha 2012 CPS3. And I think that about does it. Just close it and go back to Retro Arc like that. Um, what I want to do is I want to reset Retro Arc so I could see that on my playlist. 
and I should be able to see that on the left side, like here. So let's play a game. Let's see if this works. Does it work? Select this for entering, inserting coins, and start to start, of course. So. Start select to go to the menu and close it. CPS1 ran. Press B to get out. Let's try another game. See if this works. Now let's try CPS2. Okay, so let's try another. Let's try Street Fighter 3. This is Street Fighter Alpha 3. Street Fighter Alpha 3. Just saw that worked. It's fine. That worked. Let's try CPS three.
Welcome to the world of the street fighter queen. Prepare for battle. Yeah, I'm the way well. I got the picture. Well, I got the picture. Into the heat of battle. Go for it. Okay, that worked. I think that's about enough. Uh, so you know how to run it and everything. Use it. That's pretty much it. That's how you set it up and use uh, Capcom CPS1 to CPS3. That's what I want to share with you today. If you found this helpful, please leave a thumbs up. If you have any questions, you can leave it in the comment section below, and thanks for watching.